Here's our backyard edible garden harvest. Here we have lettuce, sugar snap peas, kumquat, some lemons, they're pretty big, three tomatoes, and another three oranges. But look at the cherry blossom tree behind me. It's so beautiful. So fragrant too, no? Yeah. I'm harvesting some lettuce today. Look at this salad garden. Look at this lettuce. I just harvested the other day for our burger. This one has bolted. And the arugula too. Look at the arugula. <laughs> Beautiful. Here's our harvest so far. Let's get more. Oh, this one is wide. Look at this. I think this should be good. Now let's go get some um, sugar snap peas. We have sugar snap peas here. We have more on the other side. Here you go our sugar snappies harvest let's check on the other side we have more here the kumquats oh uh, i think they are done probably they're done for the season i think they fell they're not crawling on the in here anymore Anyway, we still we can still have it some like this too. Okay, this one. And then look at our kumquats. These are great for like snacking and they're very very nutritious full of vitamin C a perfect food to boost your immune system And then we have two lemons. Here's our harvest for our salad. There's like one ripe tomato.
I don't want to need a tomato. But it's like... Oh, there. there you go, can I see? Cold loving tomato. And then that grows during which, winter time. Another one which looks... We're adding three tomatoes. And maybe let's harvest some oranges too. Let's harvest some oranges. Oops. Some oranges and lemon. Okay. Let's harvest maybe three. And then one more. One that is like ripe from this side. That one is dark. There we go. So we have three oranges. Here's our backyard edible garden harvest. Here we have lettuce, sugar snap peas, kumquat, some lemons. They're pretty big. Three tomatoes and another three oranges. But look at the cherry blossom tree behind me. It's so beautiful. It's so freaking too, no? Oh. I have conducted my research and I have all of these and I've estimated that we have about four. So here we have the false clover <laughs> and I forgot this but I think this is a blueberry leaf. Yeah, this is a that blueberry That is a blueberry leaf. leaf. Okay, I'll put it here. You can say it. Okay. Faster go. So here we have. So here we have. I don't know. Uh, maybe uh, a weed. I'm not sure. Okay, this one. Citronel. This one. Um, calamansi. This one. Um, uh, blueberry. This one. Uh, arugula. Uh, I like that. That explains trigonometry. Okay. Um, uh, bok choy. This one? A rose? This one? I don't know. A hibiscus maybe? Or not? A variegated calamandine? Orange? Maybe lemon? A grapes? Yes. A grapevine? Uh, another citrus? Maybe orange? Um, I don't know what that one is, but it's a flower, crawling flower, like a traveling Jew, I think. Maybe. Or uh, maybe orange? Orange? Okay. Yeah. That's very good. Another citrus? Hibiscus. Hibiscus. I like this one very much. Oh, those you are your banana to, leaves. You have to know what this is. Banana leaves, right? I'm sorry, but I, I'm sorry, viewers, but I couldn't find like a good one that wasn't teared up. So that's the. But but this one is in full condition. The uh, generation two. <laughs> Beautiful. And then here we have the stems. What is this? Uh an orange a, a lemon a lemon uh flower how about this a flower like uh maybe asian greens that bolted this lavender one? this one i don't know that but it's a flower i don't know a, a, i call this dula talap oh daisy. daisy yeah looks like daisy this one uh arugula this one uh, another asian greens that bolted this one rosemary this one uh Swiss chard, this fennel, this one? arugula, this one? Uh, <laughs> Russian kale. Oh, this one. Um, what's that? Colored greens. This one. That's me. Purple Osaka mustard. Wow, you got all of them. Yes. But except, mm, what? What? Which one did you say was a weed? This one looks like a weed. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna show you where I got it from. Now let's prepare our chicken. Now let's uh, bake this chicken shawarma in shawarma uh, seasoning. The 
after the clouded. Let's put this in. This is a 350 degree uh, preheated oven for let's try an hour first. Josh is helping spin the lettuce. Do you want me to go normal speed or do you want me to go full speed? Uh, what do you want? Show the full speed. Okay. Okay. Josh for helping spin. <laughs> okay. Very pretty edible flowers. Josh is slicing the tomatoes that he harvested from the backyard garden. I'll try how. Huh? Mm, very yummy, Josh. No? Kumquat skin is good. Oh, wow. You think that's good? <laughs> awesome. You can put the thing now, Josh. You can put the um the tomatoes on the salad. Time to slice the uh, green peas. Oh, the snow peas, super snow peas. They're sugary. They snap and they pee and they're pee pee. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, the uh, sugar snap peas. Do we need this there? Maybe no. No? That's a... Mmm. Honestly, I wouldn't no. put it that way. I would. Well, you want to eat it on its bed, sir? Crunchy. Hi, Daddy. I saw you. Mm. I would put them as a one. You do? Mm-hmm. Oh, very crunchy. Yum, yum. It's no good. Let's put a little, a little bit of huh? this kumquat. Almost. Why is this? I want to do dissect the kumquat. Okay. Oh, look at our salad. Now let's put the edible flowers. Look at this. <laughs> you had to put them in like that water. Oh, pretty. Yeah. Wow. Pretty, pretty. Can we drink the water? Oh, no, no. I don't want to drink the water. I drink the water. I thought it's like edible water. No. Look at our gorgeous salad. Now, Josh, very pretty. Very colorful. Very colorful. So here's our gorgeous salad from the backyard garden, and we're eating the salad with the chicken in shawarma seasoning. Let's eat. For our dressing, we're using this peach balsamic from Ojai, from Carolina Gram in Ojai. Hello birds. Ah, look at the yellow bird. Hello. Let's go. Oh, there's, oh, there's another one. There are three birds now. Oh, there's actually a lot. Look at this yellow one. Hello. 